Hello everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make these pretty easy, quick DIY um, small cracker presents for your guinea pigs, your rabbit. Uh, this year I kind of decided to go a bit uh, crazy with making some um, homemade um, toys for the guinea pigs and I just figured that you might be interested in watching uh, this video on how to make one yourself. Now just a disclaimer, the guinea pigs uh, cannot eat plastic wrap or ribbon. This intention of using this is purely to keep the contents in the present and clean until Christmas. When I feed this to the guinea pigs, it will be unwrapped and there will be none of this on there. They cannot eat this, so that's my disclaimer before we start. So I'll show you the bits that you need to get started. To make your own egg cracker, you'll need a piece of cellophane. The size of this will vary depending on how big your hay tube is. Two pieces of ribbon, a pair of scissors to cut everything, and a um, edible pet tube um, that you can use. You can use bigger ones than these. Um, we just intend on putting these in when we're monitoring the guinea pigs uh, on the day to eat them, so it should be perfectly fine. So yeah, this is what you need to get started. You'll also want something to fill it. So I got these Burgess XR Country herbs, and as you can see, they got all sorts of um, herbs in from mint and dandelions and floral bits. And then as well, to stuff it with even more yumminess, yeah, we got this Nature's Goodness Timothy Hay, which we picked up for two pounds from B and M. And yeah, I'll get filling this now and show you. Okay, so basically, once you've finished filling half ends with the hay, go, Ruby, with the hay uh, and the burger streets, like I showed you, you want to take it in to where your cellophane is on a table and obviously fill in it where it's like not going to mess up anything. Currently, we're in our mom's bedroom, so we don't want to go messing everything up while she comes. So, my lovely assistant Ruby here is going to help me wrap it. So this is where you get your two pieces of ribbon. Beware, guinea pigs do like to munch on ribbon. Two stories in there done that. Maybe sit there. So basically we'll grab this, wrap it over, twist and twist and twist. And then Steph, can you hold this in one hand for me there? Yes. And then we'll basically scrunch the end, grab the ribbon, and you want to just tie it in two knots twice, quite tightly, and it'll make the ends like a ribbon. Like, no Ruby, don't you go here, it's some hay. <laughs> <laughs> so you tie it in two knots like this, just so the end is nice and tight and it looks like a cracker. Give this to Ruby, here you go Ruby. And then we'll do the exact the same with the other side. Um, scrunch it, making sure all the hay is inside. And by putting your treats in the middle, it'll pre prevent them falling out either side. And you just tie it like this, nice and tightly. And there you have your finished guinea pig cracker. With a ruby bum. With a ruby bum. So, this is the finished guinea pig Christmas cracker and ruby. Loves it. See you, Ruby. <laughs> so yeah, if you would like to make your very own guinea pig Christmas cracker, then yeah, be sure to make one with this video. We hope it really helps to give you some really cool ideas. Again, disclaimer: this isn't plastic to be eaten, and the ribbon isn't to be eaten. It's to be taken off before your guinea pigs are given their treats. And if you're worried, monitor your guinea pig while you give it to them and take it away once they're finished. We hope you like this video. Do we, Ruby? You're such a pretty girl. Ready?
<laughs> and last but not least, just figured that I would mention again about the guinea pig weekly colouring book, the magical guinea pig colouring book. We've had so many amazing um, feedback from you guys about the book and it's been enjoyed by so many different people and we will be will try and eat it. <laughs> but um, if you would like one then um, you know be sure to check out our website. The colouring book is currently on offer until December 12th so if you would like to pick up a copy for somebody for Christmas um, then be sure to pop on over. Our last UK mailing day is the 12th of December and so um, yeah any any orders placed after the 12th will be shipped on the 30th of December because we're having a short break uh, after having such a busy year so uh, yeah be sure to check out our video um, about showing you more of the inside of the guinea pig colouring week and we hope you all like this quick video sorry we've been away for so long give the camera a kiss for you <laughs> It will focus. There she is. Bye for now, guys. <laughs>